Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can use Microsoft Win32 Content Prep Tool to package your setup files so they can be deployed through Win32 Apps feature in Microsoft InQ. As you all probably know by now, Windows executable files like .exe or MSI installers cannot be directly uploaded to Microsoft Intune and be deployed to your endpoints. It is not compatible. So that's where the Win32 content prep tool comes into play. It will convert your .exe or MSI installer into an extension called .intune.win which is compatible with Microsoft Intune. So let's go ahead and see how this tool works. Uh, go to this URL on your computer. Now, I will put this URL in the YouTube description box below so you can get it from there. Go to Code and click Download Zip. This should download a zip folder to your Downloads folder and it will look like this. Now, right-click on it and click Extract All to extract those zip folders. Now it will create a new folder which will be named as the same. Double click on the extracted folder, double click again and look for Intune Win App Utility.exe. So this is the program that we're going to run in order to convert our setup file or our installer file to an Intune compatible installer. So I'm going to go back one step and I'm going to show you our example setup file. So I have just downloaded Google Chrome setup file from the internet and I'll put it in this setup file folder. I think it is important that you follow the same folder structure so when you run the utility it's easy to give the folder path for the input as well as the output. As you can see, I've got a, a new folder by the name of output created. I created this before the start of the video. This is where the output will be stored once the program converts my standard MSI installer into a dot into win file, which I can then upload to into. So let's go ahead and see how this is done. First of all, I am going to go to my um, setup file and make sure that the Chrome setup.exe is there. And I'm going to go back to our content prep tool. And I'm just going to simply double click on this executable. Now, the first thing you need to do is to specify the source folder. This is the location where your um, setup file is. So let me just go back to my downloads folder and I'm just going to copy the path. Click copy as path. Uh, if it's Windows 11 that you're using, this option will be there by default. If it's Windows 10 and if this option is not showing, just right click with the shift key pressed on on your keyboard and you will see copy as path option. So let's just click copy as path and I'm going to paste it. Okay, click enter. Now I need to specify the setup file. I believe it's chrome setup.exe. Yes, so that's the file name. So let me just type that. Okay, and hit enter. And now I have to specify the output folder. So I'm just going to go back and specify my output folder. I'm going to copy as path. 
and I'm going to paste that path and hit enter. Do you want to specify catalog folder? I do not want to do that. I'm going to simply click in and hit enter. And the utility is doing its job, as you can see on the screen, and it is done. So now if I go to my output folder, I'm going to see the Chrome setup file in .intune Win extension, which is compatible with Microsoft Intune. So I can now upload this file to Intune, create a Win32 app, and deploy Google Chrome Web Browser to my endpoints using Microsoft Intune. So guys, that's it for today. Uh, I hope you learned something new. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber yet on my channel, please consider subscribing. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you and have a nice day.